obsessed. I feel like I would literally wear this is like a Coachella type of outfit. Have you sorted out a playlist? No. <laughs> anyway, party over. I'll see you for job. the next vlog. Birthday girl. Don't okay. get no. Yeah. <laughs> Got the horses in the back. Oh, I, oh, I want to marry one. Got, <laughs> Mum, all the eggs have gone everywhere. Is that okay? <laughs> Happy birthday, dear This is the reality of having a party. You have to put all of this up. We're selling these on We're selling bag. all of it. I know who it is. <laughs> <laughs> Good morning. Um, so it is the day before my birthday. It's half nine and it's Friday the 15th. So my birthday is on the 16th of October. So I'm going to be 22. I literally just put on my story as well. Like the realisation that I'm 22 tomorrow and that I still feel about 18. 22 is like a big age like I feel like I know when everyone's like oh my god you're so young like I know it's very young do you know what I mean like 30 is young like 22 is very young I feel like 21 is like you know, you're an adult but it's, it's 20 it's 21 but I feel like tw now you're 22 or now I'm 22 it's like so you're an adult now like you are a proper adult but I'm really excited um I'm having like a cowboy themed party and when I say cowboy like I came up with a theme space cowboy cowgirl cowboy because again i saw it i literally get all my inspired off tiktok not gonna lie um and it was this girl's party and it was like jade turns 23 i'll link it i saw that and i was like yeah i'm doing that i literally love it it's more like last year when i turned 21 it was very sophisticated it was very like i'll put some pictures up it was very like instagramable like white gold that kind of thing but this year it's like very colorful very not really me like i'm not the most colorful person but I feel like I just wanted to have fun. Like I didn't really want to overthink it. Like when I sent the theme in to my friends, like my group of friends, everyone was like, what the fuck is space cowgirl or boy? Space cowgirl or boy? Um, and I just sent them a TikTok and I was like, take that how you want it, interpret it how you want it. So I'm really excited to see what people wear. I've never done like a theme party and that's surprising because my birthday's in October. So it's literally like two weeks before Halloween. So I'm surprised I've never actually done like a fancy dress party or birthday theme so it's just going to be like really really colorful um i had my nails done so i had a break from my nails for such a long time and then i got them done and i just decided to go all out and yeah i really like them but it's just like a lot like, i had a family meal yesterday and i was like these are for a themed party like i don't choose to just have nails like this um but then who cares if you want like crazy nails then like fuck it go for it but um, it's just not me. I'm like, oh, I don't know. I feel a bit weird. Um, but I feel like for the party, they're going to be perfect. Um, but yeah, I'm going to bring you along with me for like the party, setting up. I can't wait. So this is the hat that I'm going to be wearing. Um, I've already added this like strip around the base because it came as like a plain hat. But I'm going to add like this stuff around the edges. So it's like fringing, if that makes sense. But I'm going to get my mum to do that with me or for me because um, we've got to use a hot glue gun and I know I'm going to burn myself if I try and use that. I'm actually so proud of what me and my mum have done. How unreal. Wait, is that a bit of makeup on the side? Oh God. I'm actually so proud of this. Look at it shining in the light. Wow. <laughs> good morning so it's my birthday it doesn't really feel like my birthday because i'm kind of like stressing a little bit back tonight but i'm really excited um i've just been to the shop got some alcohol got some bits i feel like i've done quite a bit this morning already sat with my mum and dad they gave me a present um usually my mum's like what do you want for your birthday and i'm like i have something in mind and this year i just feel like I don't know, I just wanted a surprise. I didn't really want to say like, oh, like I have my eye on this and then her get me something like it or something similar. But she came, <laughs> I'll put a clip, I think I got a clip of it because I didn't really let her know like what I was like thinking of that I wanted for my birthday or whatever. Um, she had to do something last minute and she put this like elephant, this one here, 
in a box um, and I was like that's really cute <laughs> I opened it and I was like oh that's like cute like a nice ornament for my room <laughs> What? Why have you got me an elephant? You said there's a better elephant in the box, haven't you? <laughs> no? A nice little elephant ornament for my room. Obviously, I don't know, it's, I just thought, okay, random, but fine. Um, and then she then proceeded to tell me that they'd booked like a safari, not safari, but like one of them um, like days out where you can like feed animals. I'll put the name of it here, but basically next year I'm gonna go and you can get really close to all the animals. So you can get close to like elephants, rhinos, penguins, tigers, giraffes. What you do is like you help them out for the day. So basically her present that she got me is shoveling shit for a day, which is perfect, you know, I love that. No, just joking. You you probably will have to help them out, like feed them and whatever, but you can get really close to them. So yeah, I'm really looking forward to that. Um, And yeah, I've had like a few deliveries to my door. My phone is literally going off. Getting messages is like the nicest thing. Like I feel like it's so nice, but if you know me, when I get like messages or like whatever, it makes me feel a bit like, oh, like, I don't know. I love it. I'm obviously not complaining about getting birthday messages, but it's like, I'm such a bad replier. The thought of like having a quite a lot of messages to get back to really scares me. You can hear my phone going off now. Um, obviously not complaining about getting happy birthday messages. Like it's so nice that people even think about me on their day-to-day -day business. Do you know what I mean? Um, and I've got some flowers. So basically I got these flowers through my door. They're literally huge. Um, also I'm hiding my hands because I've done my fake tan so bad. Like it's it's a joke like it's so bad i need to scrub it with like i think people say to scrub it with toothpaste and then that helps so i've got to do that before later i did my fake tan last night i tried to wash it off but it just wasn't coming off and obviously i haven't done fake tan for ages so over the summer i don't really wear fake tan but over winter i've tried to stop getting sunbeds so fake tan is does anyone else do anything that they can not just not to go downstairs and get scissors like i will use anything this is a makeup brush because i'm too lazy to go downstairs and get scissors i have a feeling who this might be from but we will see oh, it's definitely not from a boy that's for sure that's fine not that we need that I feel like I'm like holding an award. <laughs> Thank you so much, Blogger Agent, you're the best. And that's probably Claudia, Lucia and the rest of them. They're such nice girls, honestly. I feel so lucky and blessed to have them in my life. It's 12, 16 now. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna start, I know it's quite early, but I'm gonna start setting up. I feel like it's gonna be a long day. Like my 21st last year went so quickly. So I'm just like, I don't want that to happen this year. Like I want it to be like, I can enjoy every moment. Like I feel like I've really enjoyed my morning. Um, I'm excited to see my sister. My sister's gonna come over. She's made my cake. That's one thing I asked her to do for a present. I said, please, can you make my cake and some cookies? Um, and I kind of sent her some like Pinterest pictures of what I liked. And I'm excited to see how she's like interpreted that and like how she's made the cake. But I'll show you guys that later. And yeah, I showed you my hat yesterday. How unreal is the hat? Hang on, that's like not gonna obviously be there. I'm obsessed. I feel like I would literally wear, this is like Coachella type of outfit. Like I'm gonna wear, if I go to Coachella 2022, I'm wearing this hat. I don't give a fuck. I'm wearing this hat again. I should start making these. I, would, I feel like people would actually buy these off Etsy or something. Wow. So this is all the bits that I need to start getting out now. But like table covers, these are balloons. This is either, oh, it's a happy birth, pink happy birthday star. I've got this as part of my outfit as well. It's like a pink toy gun. Um, these posters, I'll show you what I'm doing with these in a bit as well. Um, these are like for shots. So you fill them up with like, I don't know, vodka or whatever shot you want. And then you squirt it in people's mouths. <laughs> um, so that's going to be interesting. And then, these are for shots as well. I thought they were quite cool. Like you put them in, I've got like these little test tube like holders. And then people can like, when they come in, just take it and then shut it. And then I've got, I don't actually know. Oh, I think that says Yeehaw. And it's like a, I think it's either silver or pink. I'm not sure. And I've got like these pink champagne glasses. I think I'm going to fill these with sweets actually. Like these sweets. I've got like loads of mentos, like pink sweets, like Lindor's. 
million. I used to have these all the time as a child. Like these are my favourite. It's like straws here. Got that cow print bunting. In that box is like these pink, like you know those American style cups. Um, and then this is part of my outfit. Um, but I literally got everything from Amazon. Um, Amazon's like my go-to. Also, I'm covering all the walls in like this silver shredded like tinsel stuff. And that's gonna go on the tables. Yes, yeah, so I think that's everything. So I'm gonna take all of this downstairs now. And I'm also waiting for Hamuza to come and help me. But he's gonna be late. I just have a feeling. And he's already texted me, joking around, saying he's gonna be late. But I know he's actually gonna be late. Um, so that's stressing me out. Um, but we shall see what time he gets here. <laughs> Just on my way to pick Camus up from the station now. He is actually on time, so that is a good start. This is not gonna stay here, but literally putting you in reverse is gonna knock you off of this thing. We'll see how long you stay there for. Ready for this bump? Whoop. Shit, nearly reverse into my garage. What's new? Um, I think I might be the one who's gonna be late, but no matter how much time I give myself to leave, it's always that last 10 minutes before you leave somewhere, isn't it? That is like, you're trying to get your shit together. I mean, today wasn't that bad because I'm not ready. Do you know what I mean? But sorry, it's so dark in here. Like, I thought it was going to be all decent weather today, but it's like pouring with rain and all the speakers were outside. So I was like, fucking hell. That would have been a nightmare. But luckily, we got them in on time. But yeah, Hamiz is coming early to help me set up. So this is going to be the third vlog that he's in. Hamiza's train is just getting in now. He actually was on time. I'm so shocked. Um, so I was nearly going to be late, but I said I can't be late because if he's on time and he's always late, I have to be on time. Can you see all the chairs in the back that I've got to get out for later as well? I literally saw Hamiza last night and picked the chairs up from there as well. Um, this is my second Red Bull of the day as well. And I feel like I talk a lot quicker when I've had Red Bull and I can't help it. His train just pulled in. I don't think he's ever come to the station before. My station's actually in the middle of nowhere, but he's come from East Croydon. Um, so you can kind of get anywhere from East Croydon really, I feel. Yeah, I'm filming myself. Is that okay? Honestly, when people see you filming, I mean, I've really had to get used to it because it's like you're a freaking alien. And don't even get me started about taking Instagram pictures. Oh my God, when you take Instagram pictures in public, the looks that you get, and it really pisses me off. I've had to get used to that because, is that him? I thought he was carrying a bike. Uh, yeah, the looks that you get are crazy. Like I've nearly got into arguments with people because they're like, they'll walk past you and they'll be like, it's like, what? Like, have you never seen someone take a picture before? There's so many people coming up the station now. I'm getting embarrassed about talking to the camera. <laughs> oh, he looks nice. Look at him. Watch him get annoyed about my bag being there already. Are you ready for it? Excuse me. I look rough. Bro, oh, what's new? The gloves are uh, going to be rough tonight. Let's hope so. I told them that you was going to be late. And I was convinced that you were going to be late. And I was like, this boy's never on time. And then I was nearly going to be late. I was here You're waiting. You're always for you. late. Have you sorted out a playlist? No. <laughs> anyway, party I over. I'll see you for job. the next vlog. Um, but I'm really hoping my mum doesn't watch the like, festival I'm vlog while we eat. Are you enjoying the vlog? <laughs> <laughs> No, give me this. Oh god, get a I'm grip. Watching. Yeah, you are a good looking man. Like, I'm you look watching. Nice. Look at me. Cheers. Like, look at the fit. Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> <laughs>
so messy bag. This feather bow is from Amazon. The hat I showed you already, the hat's from Amazon and then the little jewels are from Amazon as well. Top is from Pretty Little Thing. Belt is Amazon. Skirt is Urban Outfit and the boots are Public Desire. Um, so yeah, that's my outfit. I'm gonna go enjoy the rest of my night. And I'm gonna film as much as I can, but we will see how that goes. So yeah, I love you all and hopefully I'll speak to you guys tomorrow and be very, very hungover. Hello. <laughs> Working bitch. At least work at 8 p.m. Wait, what time did you leave? I got there at 7 and I left literally like half an hour ago. And it is a Saturday, so hats off to my Oh, then Miss Elliot, alright. Yeah. 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 I thought you were connected to my speaker. I was like, oh, Sorry, thank you, you so much. No, I, I was just kidding. But I was worried that that was connected to the downstairs. Uh, look at Molly's hat. She diamond today. Diamond. Did you do that yourself? Oh, 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 no, she's been nice. Christelle! How is your Christelle? Meow! I haven't got any many more clothes on like you. That's not a short, it's a test tube. No. Oh my god. I can see you. I thought I thought that was a Horses in the back. <laughs> 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 
Oh my god, they're so beautiful. No, we're not getting on it. You can't go mouth to mouth with you. Why can't it? Okay, give it to that one. I fucking love it. I want to marry one. People are crying over Mrs. Too much. All the eggs came out. Mum, all the eggs have gone everywhere. Is that okay? <laughs> as long as we're having a good time, right? You're doing a shot. Okay, I'm doing a shot. Okay, cheers. 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 Lovely breakfast. Oh my god. What did you drink? <laughs> <laughs> Even though the dancing's done, don't worry, cause the night is young. Currently, what time is it, Hamuza? It's about half four in the morning. Hamuza's making me tidy up this whole party. Do you want to see the mess? Hamuza's telling me to tidy up right now. What are we saying? We're not going to be able to have another party here if we don't clear up now. People have just left their shit here. Like, what that's is that? The whole costume. There's a whole costume that someone's left in here. Like, what am I? That's going in the bin. This is the reality of having a party. You have to clear up all of this up, all of this. We're selling these. On We're the selling event. all of it. No one's left me any food. Guys, look at all my flowers that I got. How cute. Um, guys, my phone case is there. Oh, not the phone case. <laughs> that slippers are so uncomfortable. Honestly. Maybe because they don't fit you. <laughs> Wait, I made these sweets Give for everyone. The Wait, Give me the vlog. no. Look at this, yeah. Look at this. Never invite them again. Ew, I just have like liquid on my phone. What the hell is this? Happy birthday to lovely card book, it's, it's chapter 22, baby. Wait, who's it from? From Joseph, Max, Tay, Adam and Becky. Oh, that's so nice of them. Let's cut some cake. But you could have had some of these, you know what this I mean? I made this all nice. <laughs> no, seriously, we need to clear up. Okay, this is what we're going to do. We're going to clear up. And we're going to eat some cake. Okay, good night, guys. had to put it up there because people were trying to steal it and they would have put it on ebay and it actually would have gone for about eight quid so Not the baby eight. girl is just chilling up there good night honeys no. love you all when you have Hamuza snoring to send you to sleep. Mm -hmm. No more snoring, please. Thank you. VIP ticket only. Da my husband's name on it. I didn't ever realise. Don't get my face there, please. <laughs> okay, let me guess. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Who is it? I'm scared. <laughs> I feel like I want to give you a clue. No, because as soon as you give me a clue, I'm going to know who it is. Okay. I'll do the middle bit. I know who it is. Who? I know who it is. Yeah. <laughs> 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 you don't get it. When? In March. We've got very peas? No, I just don't know that. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God, who is that? And it's got, what has it got their writing as well? It actually looks like, you know, like know. their actual writing. Oh, thank you so much. <laughs>